You're right, gentlemen, in case you missed the preceding episode. It's Cadet Williams, somewhat of a memory expert, whom we last saw making a pre-flight inspection without a checklist. And for his first mission, too. You're overcorrecting a little there, aren't you? That's right, relax. You haven't got anything to worry about much. You know your stuff as far as you've gone, and you know your bomb site's in good condition. Or at least you ought to know it. You made the pre-flight inspection, didn't you? Okay, here we go, mister. I know you're wishing you good luck, because there isn't any luck in this business. You either learn it or you don't. And you're either right or you're wrong. Get set. Now, switch is on. CDI switch on. Servo on. Bomb side switch on. Freight motor switch on. Stabilizer running and all warmed up. Now, while you're on the way up, set that disk speed so that the optics will drive at the right speed for your altitude. Table says 326.9. 326.9. Right. That looks like it. But you can't be sure without a double check. Two correct readings. Okay. Now for trail. 47 mils. Get the rest of the data now, so you'll know the CIA. Here's your chance. Show the lieutenant you know what's doing. Bombardier to pilot, go ahead. CIA 6920. Open bomb bay doors. Are you sure they're open? Light on. Okay. Wait a minute. Release lever on safe? Safe. Go ahead. That's right. Level up stabilizer with the fore and aft bubble. Lock it good and tight. Uh, uh you'd be doing something to hit that target from here. That one's on the other leg of the range. All right, this is your range. See if you can pick up the target. No, no, not with a sight, just with your eyes. Maybe you didn't know. When they laid out the reins, they forgot to paint in the diagrams. I bet they forgot to do that in Tokyo, too. All right, Lieutenant, he's your baby now. Pick a landmark. See that nearest dry lake? The target's that white spot beyond it and a little to the left.
You're forgetting something, mister. Turn extreme forward vision in. Get on the target. Clutch in so the stabilizer will hold the sight line steady in asthma. Uncage the vertical gyro so you'll have a steady vertical reference, no matter how much the plane rocks. Well, mister, remember that pre-flight inspection procedure that you learned by heart? Couldn't be that you forgot number 21, could it? Instructed a pilot, sight malfunction. Let's go down. What's the matter? Air sick? Makes you feel like kicking yourself, hmm? Well, how would you feel if it had happened over an enemy target? Yes, a lot of valuable time wasted. Here we go again, and good enough. You didn't forget that extreme forward vision this time. Now, one cage your gyro. Now, let's get on that target. Watch closely to see which way you're drifting. The wind is pushing off to the right of the target. Double grip and turn back slowly. Better get back on the target so you can see what you're doing. Drift to the right, so turn them back. Easy now. Drift seems to be killed, so back again on target. Overcorrected there a bit. Turn the extreme forward vision out before you lose the target. And get back on target. Drifting off to the left now. So double grip the knobs and turn them forward. Easy does it. Better turn on your rate motor. Got your course pretty well set. Now let's see what you can do about rate. You can judge your rate better if you put it back on target. Driving a little slow. You're trying to find that one point on the scale, remember? That's coming along. Let's see what the lieutenant has to say about it. I'm a dear to pilot. Okay to level, sir. Level, level. Level carefully, so you can keep that vertical reference line. Let us see how much time you've got. Planning a dry run? Set your selector lever. Those rack switches help, too. And don't forget your automatic release lever. Getting pretty close. Instructor switch. Not much time. Don't make any big corrections. Bombs away.
Right motor off. Okay to turn, sir. Stabilizer unclutched. Rate index at 0.5. Fighting angle at 70 degrees. Disc speed knob on low speed. Trail arm at zero. Good, huh? In fact, terrific. And what a nice big pair of ears you have to tell it to. Except that here's another friend of yours, and he was along on that first run. Remember? What's that? Free flight penalty. Well, here's something, Mr. Memory Expert, for you never to forget. Oh, well, you might be buying extra beers graduation night, Cadet Williams. But I don't think Lieutenant Williams is Bombardier will ever forget to complete a pre-flight inspection.